Alrighty then, good afternoon once again everyone. Silver Dragon here, coming at you with some more Clockwork Empire. It's going to be continuing where the last left off. Let's go ahead and resume here and let them uh, get to work. Let me actually produce a couple more black... Or no, I'm not actually producing the black boards yet. Never mind! Never mind then, what does it take? Uh, chalkboards require two planks. Okay. So right now we have one of the three booze vats, which also require four planks. Dear lord. This alone is going to require three lacquered planks, which we should almost have. Just need to make one more batch, eventually. I think the main issue might be low on planks. Yeah, we are definitely low on planks. That alone is costing us a small fortune. I'm going to get some more laborers for the woodworkers here, I think. I should probably hire the next batch of people here properly. Remove you. Throw you in the carpenter's workshop. Hmm. Now the overseers have their skills, but the individual workers, I'm not really sure if they have also have their own skill preferences. It would definitely make uh, much more sense to arrange them in such a fashion, but... I can't be 100% of the effectiveness if I tried, so yeah. Anywho, let's take a look here. How are we doing right now? We only have one rough stone, so I'm going to keep this going for... Holy crap! Jar of Chica. Fermented maize. It'll do for a night at the pub. We have a hundred of them. I only told you to make like 30. What the hell? Yeah, make a minimum of 40 each, so it'll be 80 and you've made 100. You've gone a little bit overboard, my friend. We have 8 farmer stew right now. We still have 56 maize chowder. I don't think they're drinking it. That's the only explanation I can think of. No, they are drinking it. Alright, we got 3 more immigrants. So, let's get them to work. It's a sign... One more to the carpenter, so I guess we max out the carpenter here. Well, do we need that many? Not really, but I'll give it to him anyway. Give him another guy again. We can start spreading them out a little bit more. We are going to need another uh, dormitory soon. I'll probably do it with a medium class one as well. Probably actually will put it down here, to be honest. But anyway, how are we doing over here? We're slowly getting all this broke down. Slowly. Okay, I'll let the mine keep working. Temporarily. Alright, let's get those chalkboards built. Uh, let's max that up. 19. We do have some more wood kind of scattered around a bit, like there's this one right here. Bit of bamboo. They should have chopped some down here already. It doesn't look like they, ha like they have the... Ooh, actually we have all this wood over here. Yeah, let's give them that task. Another glowing report. We have done well. So we are now 15, plus 15. Ooh, one elite steam knight. That would be nice. Ah, I definitely want me that. Ooh, but we have no reason to summon it right now, but that would be badass. So we've made all the glass that we could need. Lab's been built. Uh-oh. Diplomacy points are full, I know. I know. Okay, let's get to work on military. Let's assign... Who am I assigning? Let's give it to her. Okay. And we got another overseer. 
And it's a naturalist. Let me give her some additional help here. Excellent. Hopefully that gets built up pretty quickly. So we should get the both of them working fairly quickly, I hope. We don't have any sulfur around here, so we can't really do a hell of a lot with that. Let's build a couple more lacquer planks. I'm sure we'll need them for something. Worst comes to worst, I can sell them for a decent price, I think. Although I can't see the value of a single one right now. Uh, nope, it's not going to tell me. Oh, well. No, I'll kind of leave that as is for now. Alright. Can't do anything here right now. Alrighty then. So we're doing pretty decently for the moment. We still need a crap ton of planks. Among other things that we're doing. Oh yeah, we still got all the... Actually, I don't need... So we apparently already had another chalkboard. Let's go ahead and make uh, 20 of each for the planks there and just leave it as is for now. There's not too, too much else we can do at the moment here. Oh, as I'm still waiting for this little bugger to be constructed. So now that we have our lab going and assigned, we should start seeing some science generating here fairly soon. It'll take a while, but still. Um, we'll probably go with optimized training, I think. That way they can train a bit faster. Scientific sharpshooting by applying a statistical analysis to time and motion studies, practices embodied in the current manual of training. We may identify methods for increasing accuracy of weapons fire and therefore damage output per unit. That would also be nice, but I think I want to get with the training first just so I can make sure that each of them are training properly. Or quickly, I should even say. Oh nice, he just leveled up. Sweet. He is now a expert ceramics artist, I should say. Alright, let's get a whole bunch. Wow. So two stone and two clay yields one, really? I mean, it's, oh geez, yeah, the glass is so much better. New day, let's see if we have something else I can get now. Fine, let's call in some food. There we go, we got snossages. Also some bread. That'll add to our pile, so anytime we get some more workers requested, we'll just invite them. Say yes to all workers. Like now loading, please wait. Or in this case, saving. Cough. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's like I changed angles and it froze for a second there. I was worried for a moment. All right, how we doing here? That's all getting constructed. Who is your teammate, madame? So she is working on it. Good. In that case, let me withdraw one from him. He's actually a level 3 naturalist, too, and give it to her. That way we can speed up the production of science as much as possible. Okay. Still waiting on the 16 planks. I actually have a bunch of military personnel for some reason. Oh, that's why, because they're all gathered together. I see. 
Unfortunately, this name is not displaying, possibly because of the 52 I added on. I don't know. Let's go... what? Instigator Paddlefoot. That works. And your name shows up properly. Yay. That fixed that. So you can't use numbers. Or at least not as the entirety of the name. We got another... What the hell. Another uh, farm worker. Not that we need that right now, but hey, welcome! We already got three, which is good. Alright. We're producing a decent amount of uh, bric-a-brac now, because apparently glass makes really, really good bric-a-brac. Or brac, whatever the hell. Words. God damn it. Alright, let's get rid of this then. Produce the booze, vats. And then just a whole bunch of planks. Let me actually give some... Additional plank-based jobs here. No, I want them to chop down all the trees down south here. So if we do that alone, it should be more than enough. We actually have a whole bunch up here, never mind. So we have a ton of logs. They just aren't bloody using them. Hmm. Established bo botanical taxidermy. Interesting. Survey natural environment. I wonder if that means it's actually going to produce one of the taxidermy pieces. Who knows? Who knows? Probably not. Let's try producing some rugs. Actually. Let's try getting two carpets. And... I'll produce that right at the entrance there as they come in. So let's go one carpet. That was fast. And one rug. We'll see if they build either of them here. If it's an either or thing, then fantastic. I mean, we could literally cover the entire floor with rugs and we would be making a fortune. Oh wow, is he just telling her off? What, what's going on here? Oh no, they're happy. They're super happy right now. Adequate nut uh, nutrition, the workplace kind of sucks, which is not surprising. Safety is fantastic. Uh, they're engaged in military training where he was blamed. He got a plus three for being blamed? Okay. Anyway. How is the barracks? Yeah, it's typical. At least it's not horrible. How are we doing in here now, actually, that we built the two uh, additional... Oh, it's down to typical, which is, or up to typical, I should say. So now that we have the two extra clotheslines and the last of the cupboards built, it's looking good. Uh, how are we doing here? Just need the planks. Just need 16 planks. And we just finished the vats, so literally all we're doing now is producing planks. And we have just barely enough to enough here. We'll produce a few extras as well. We can always use more planks. We'll be needing a bunch of uh, something soon here. So I need an extra workshop there. Unless I want to stretch it over here. I don't think so. You know what? Let's move the door here. Let's move the door. Yeah, I'll put the entrance over here. That way I can... Hmm. I can move this. Alright, we'll do that. 
Once they're done with this, I'm gonna delete it. So, Mathis. Mathis Pater. We're gonna demolish his zone, and we're gonna move it probably just next to this one. That way I can build the next decent level of housing over here. Actually, let me move this over one more. Excellent. We're going to need a lot of planks and other things for this next one, too. Because we're going to build a medium class uh, residence with all medium class beds and everything. Alright. And I think I'm going to get the other barracks over here. Well, we got nothing but time for the moment here, so just gotta wait. There we go. And we got three new people, fantastic. Mathis. Alright. Let's assign the new peeps. Let's get everyone something. As many people as I can. Gotta give them at least one worker. There's gotta be a limit, though, to the amount of freaking, uh... What the hell. Not civilians. The amount of, uh... Overseers we can get here. Otherwise, it's just gonna be insane. Okay, how are we doing? Are we getting close to 16? We're at 3. No. No, we're not getting close to 16. They do drink out here, but I'm assuming, I'm hoping, assuming and hoping that, oh, what the hell just happened? Oh, yes, I zoomed on the mini-map and it did that again. Quite. Uh, that the inn here, or the public house, will allow us to maybe consume more. Probably that's why the reason, the reason why they're so damn happy right now is because I gave them a decent amount of alcohol. Malachite. Hematite. That's unfortunate. We have to make a stretch mine here. Because for some reason it didn't uh, put a node over here for coal. That is a little ridiculous, isn't it? That is going to be one crazy mine, that's for damn sure. But I need to stretch it more, I think. Difficult. Damn it. Should I just build two and be done with it? It's not like I don't have the spare overseers. That is true. I'm actually not sure how close I need to build this, though, for it to take a proper effect. Okay, good enough. And, of course, it's gonna fuck up because of the damn saving! Ah! Frustrating! Grr. Oh, well. Nothing you do. That 
looks like it's covering both properly. All right. Well, it looks like it might be doing three worth. We'll find out once I get everything in place. Okay. Let's actually get this one. Scheduled for demolition. So maybe we don't have to rebuild everything. Maybe they will properly tear apart all the modules, store them back away, and then destroy the building. Sweet. I hope so. And we have a dodo, apparently. Well then. Welcome, noble bird. I hope one day to be able to tame you and harvest eggs, which would be delicious. How are we doing in the plank department here? Fifteen, so we need one more plank and we can get her going. Let's see how we're doing here. Alright. Produce five. We got another overseer. My lord. Too many overseers. Too many overseers. Seriously. You're gonna have to, like, ridiculously... You have to triple my list here so I can scroll through everybody without going... Going down a mile. My lord. Alright, they're tearing her apart. I hope. Looks like he's getting her done, finally. Oh, did we build the rug here yet? We did! Excellent, it's great quality now. In that case... Try building an upper class rug. I'm pretty sure all rugs currently are just from the same base product. So if you build a single rug or carpet, I believe, from here, it should build that. Of course, it's invisible now, but hey, whatever. That's nothing new. We still have the smelting crucible. Oh, yes, the smelting crucible. Yeah. Forgot about that. We should have more than enough planks now. And that was weird. I couldn't click on that for a second there. No, actually we have 11. So something was using up planks. Weird. Well, well oh, this is probably using up planks, isn't it? Uh, of course it is. Really? You assholes. I'm not... I'm honestly not surprised, though. I'm really not. So, of course they would. Of course they would. Now I'm just going to wait for somebody to actually get over there and build that. Now, honestly, though, even with it as is, it should produce coal. I don't know why I was so stuck up on trying to get these coal reserves. Because even just a base mine does mine coal. So, I don't know. Guess I'm just out of it. <laughs> Anywho. Oh, dear lord, we have enough maize to drown in. How's our food supplies, though? Or our food supplies are fine. Uh, actually, we don't have nearly as much maize as I thought we did. That should be alright, though. Of course, beer production is through the fucking roof. I could cancel that right now. We have enough beer to last us at least three, you know, well, two full consumptions at the moment here. So if everyone decided to have one beer, uh, we'd be able to go for two rounds. Okay, now I need to think about my other prioritizations, because I really got to get a blacksmith up and running. But I want this damn public house built first. So my priorities are public house, mine, and then we'll build the blacksmith, and then finally we'll get the medium class quarters built. A fairly large medium class quarters. Oh, they actually built some of this. And they canceled the rest, you bastards. 
I swear to God, people, you're beginning to piss me off. Actually, one second here. So they constructed invisible Gambians. Of course they did. Of course they did. Oh, and look what just happened, which is no fucking surprise. Really? Why? Effing why? Ugh, they really need to go do a work on these Gambians. They have got to look into this, because, you know, number one, the terrain here is not viable to build Gambians. Number two, bullshit. Anyway, moving on. Write a glowing report. Mine was built. Who are we gonna chuck in here? I guess. All right. So let's take a look at this then. No products yet because we don't have any mines. Now I saw somebody was going to build Gambians. God damn, that's fucked up. Well, hopefully if I save and reload, it'll properly show up. Colonist has a suspicious proposal. I deny you. Please tell me you have 16 planks. We have 19 planks. Somebody get their ass over here and build this. God damn it. It's like, swear to God, don't make me deconstruct that and reconstruct it. Don't make me do it, damn it. Yeah, let's try this here quickly. Let me save and exit to the main menu and reload and see what happens. Also, we'll see if the save and exit to main menu command works properly this time around. Come on. Hmm. Of course not. Why would it? Why would that work? That's silly! You silly man! With your foolish dreams of functioning gameplay features. Cough. Day 22. Population of seven, 47 people. Load. Let's hope we don't instantly lose progress. That would be bullshit. Colossal bullshit. But I wouldn't be surprised. I would not be surprised. I'm really beginning to wonder though if they're ever going to fix the like variety of bugs related to Gabians because it seems like they've just been absolutely ridiculous for a long time. I remember they showed an, an image of one guy's colony where he'd surrounded it completely in Gabians and had everything constructed in a similar way to me uh, right now, although we had like small just buildings kind of separated from each other inside it looked pretty much like a walled small town essentially i can't imagine he had very high population count but anyway that's what it looked like and i can't imagine how the hell he got that done because i've just i've never had an entire proper wall because of just all the freaking issues that they have i don't know man i just don't know anyway dear lord and they're still invisible. Lovely. Oh, wait. What? No. No, these ones are. I can even dismantle them, so... I guess we're going to be defended by invisible walls. Let's even watch him build this here. That is really damned annoying. That one built properly. Properly. 
weird. Is anybody gonna build this building? Anybody? Anyone? Hello? People? No? Okay. Uh, one of these days. One of these days. Hmm. Oh. Beatrice Goldenwill is building something. Hopefully this. Well, we'll give it another couple of minutes here before I call this. Actually, she might be working on this down here, even. Did we get our modules back, though? I should be checking. I don't think we did. In that case, build me a couple more mine shafts, please. It's a matter of just planks. That's fine. Oh, well. I was hoping that they would have recovered the uh, modules, but it doesn't look like they did. So you really got to be careful when designing your buildings. If you had to destroy one, you're basically writing it off as a loss. Oh well. Anyway. Just got to wait now. Again, I really wish I could speed up time. <laughs> that would help me a lot right now. Oh, Beatrice. You are a saint. I dub thee Saint Beatrice. And then you put it on the fucking ground, didn't you? You bitch. How dare you? How dare you? God damn it. Are you kidding me? It's like the hatred of a thousand suns. As she drops it, now she just tra la 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 la's her way over to finish the job. It's like, you've got to be kidding me, really? Honestly, now? It's like one log, or one plank, two plank, three planks, four planks. I'm getting there. One plank at a time now. One plank at a time. Hurry up, girl. Come on. I used to carry around eight two by fours at a time. Move your ass. With that, let's start getting some chairs. There we go. 14 chairs. That'll be enough to finish that up. I don't see any more invisible gabions being constructed, so that's good. I mean, if I go into here and try and construct it again, we will see... You know, the red bit is there, I can't build, so they are there, but we just can't see them. But the question is, will the AI still react to them as a proper wall? And I just don't know. Now, we finally have all the components here, so we don't have to worry about that anymore. Uh, let me build one more structure here, and then we'll call that there for now, I think. There we go. Get the Metalworks Workshop. Ooh. That thing looks sexy. Extraction of additional ore from stone. Ooh. You know what? No, let me cancel that. Let me cancel that, because we're going to build this thing bigger. Bigger! More badass than ever before! Just because of the sheer amount of... Well, that's a little bit ridiculous there. Uh, due to the sheer amount of stuff you can actually build in this thing. I don't want to make it... I don't want to make it uneven, though. So we'll go like this. That should be enough. Because honestly speaking, right now, there's not a hell of a lot we can actually put in here. So, yeah. Welcome, new laborers. Can we move this? Alright, we got a workbench. Let's 
slot that in between there. Got the stone smelting crucible. Smithing forge. Power lathe would be really nice. Ah! Interesting. Let's see. Companion to the power stamper, the power lathe makes pipes and weapon barrels extremely quickly via the use of tiny, uh, what is it? Athric vortices. Please keep all items firmly attached to, uh, to your person when standing near the vortices. Or glorious chaos will, assume, uh, will ensue, I should say. Iron charcoal kiln. Here we go. We got a brick charcoal kiln right there. All right, let's have this work on a brick charcoal kiln for us. I need two iron before it can be done though, so we'll have to wait on that. But hey, all in all, we're not doing too bad. So this is finally being constructed. That guy's been designated. Somebody should get building this soon here, I hope. So all the components are where they need to be for the most part. This should get built up and then we'll be good to go. But yeah, I could put a, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave a gap right here. So I can put a door on the back here and then create some high gabions leading to this. A letter from the Ministry congratulated you on meeting or exceeding 50 immigrants to your settlement. Take this commemorative landmine to celebrate your excellent colony management skills. Please handle the commemorative landmine with care. Uh, okay. It's literally one landmine. It's literally one landmine. Alright, let me quickly assign these three new workers. give one to you and then we'll spread the rest out here Ooh, you're actually a level 3 naturalist nice okay not too bad she's finally finally getting this baby built long last we'll have our public house at long last I think I'll go to 40 with this one here just get it a few more things finished up that's a uh, that's missing its proper icon Unfortunate, unfortunate. Luckily, we already have most of what we need for this. Alright. I can't do that right now. At least not there, but I can do it over here. Alright, we'll flatten this out so I can build the walls in between it. Of course, again, will they be constructed properly? Who knows? I'm betting probably not, but hey. One does what one can. So the public house has finally been built. I don't need to assign anybody to this. Quality is typical right now. We have zero pints available, but we now have the keg here built, so hopefully they will start uh, putting all the alcohol in there. Of which we should still have 152. Holy balls, you crazy people. You damn crazy people, I swear, my god. Also, how are we doing here quickly before I call this? Let's get optimized training researched. Rather than traditional slap uh, dash off the cuff uh, brow beating of training, develop a regime of soldiery training based on scientific principles. This should increase military speed of training by 5%. You hear that, soldier? Sir, yes, sir. Let's also get optimized shop shooting since we have enough points for that. By applying the analysis, increase the damage that we do to our targets. Fantastic. So now that's done, we got both of those. Let's uh, focus on agriculture now. So we'll have harvest practices, which will unlock tobacco. We also have enhanced growth alignment. And the radius crop planting, which we've seen before, but the of course the harvest plant practices are new for this area. So we'll unlock tobacco, which will likely make some really nice products for us. But anyway, let's go ahead and call this here. So we've done a pretty good job here. Let me actually see if they moved any pints in yet. They have not yet. It's a bit of an uncomfortable quality, but as we get some chairs in, I hope that will change. Although let me verify for a second that chairs even make a damn difference for that. It might even make it worse, actually. Public house. Yeah, they don't add any decorative value whatsoever. So I'm going to have to add some... I'll probably add some rugs in here or something. Just to quickly increase the value. Also, do we build the rug over here? We did not yet. 
Oh well, that's unfortunate. Anywho, let's save this up. So thank you very much for watching, everybody. Hope you've all enjoyed. Uh, next time around, we'll finish up the Smith Workshop. Hopefully, we'll get that area leveled up. I don't know if I'll build the Gambians to that yet. I'll probably try and focus a bit more on getting them built how I need them to be. But I honestly doubt they're going to function very well. They haven't. They, they almost never have. So I'm kind of doubtful that they ever will. Or at least in a short period of time, that is. Anywho, have yourselves a great one, everyone. And I will catch you all next time with some more Clockwork Empires. Peace out for now.